Hey guys and welcome along to a another quick tutorial, a quick video. I'm gonna uh, make like a, maybe a quick series on some interesting tools here. So interesting tools in Nina, <laughs> that's probably the name or something similar. And in today's uh, episode, I'm connected here uh, with the Windows remote uh, client on my um, little remote PC on the telescope. I've not set up anything yet, I just connected everything in Nina and did the stuff. So, and now, well, what's the first thing? We need to make sure that our autofocus is set. And um, in order to do so, of course, we can already slew to a target. I'm currently imaging the Sol Nebula, so I could slew to there, but it may be a bit tricky or, or maybe it's not easily visible and maybe you're using a not a um, diesel R, or maybe you're using some filters, narrowband filters. So for that case, you can simply um, use this tool here. Wait, here, this one. Manual focus targets. I think it should be um, default and not a plugin. So I think um, it should be, well, as I said, a default uh, tool here. Then you just select it here and then it pops up. If it's not there, maybe it's uh, below here in the bottom line. And then it's just really simple. You select a bright star. And for me, uh, currently Sirius is uh, in a great spot in the south and it's also high enough. So I can easily spot Sirius here. Um, it gives you the coordinates and then you can just simply say slew to target. I mean, it's no big deal. <laughs> Actually, it's a simple tool, but uh, simple, but you know, sometimes the easy things are the ones that are most uh, useful. So yeah, just wanted to share that. Now the telescope is slowing. You can check that by looking into my, oh no, not that one, preview. See, telescope is slowing. That's my um, webcam. I'm streaming that. So maybe at one time, maybe there will be also a tutorial. But currently I'm having the dual setup. And you see, um, it's slowing to the south. We may not see Sirius here on the screen, but it certainly is moving and it went there and that worked. Okay, settled. And now I can just go over um, to my imaging. Ah, sorry, I'm already at the imaging, but I can go to just image and then we can try to see if we, let's say five seconds, if we are um, on target, just a quick shot. And there we have it, Sirius. Worked perfectly. I uh, don't need plates of him, but uh, maybe, uh, of course my, my mount was already um, polar aligned, so that makes it more <laughs> easy, but like the bright stars you should be able to find. And then once that's done, you can simply run the autofocus tool and yeah, start the session. So that's what I'm doing now. And that's so much a one, the first video in the series, quick tips, uh, tools. Uh, I already forgot the name, you know, you know the name, you can read the title. So uh, thanks for watching and <laughs> clear skies to all of you. Chris out, see ya guys.